Josh Woodrum was a record-setting quarterback during his time at Liberty, but even with that success, sticking in the NFL was far from easy. Josh would spend time with four different organizations, all without going through a training camp, and yet despite that, he knew he belonged in the league. Now, could he just find a team that felt the same way? I really felt like, you know, I could play in the league and just only getting a tryout and then being like, yeah, you know, nothing. That was discouraging for sure. And then finally my agent was like, I got to work out with the Ravens if you want to go. And I was like, yeah, of course I want to go. Like, how else am I supposed to get on a team if I don't? And so then worked out and they ended up really liking me and came to preseason and then preseason happened. What happened was that Woodrum blew up. In his first chance to play in an NFL preseason, Josh would complete nearly 70% of his passes to go along with two TDs through the air and two on the ground. It was in the midst of this run of success that Josh started to think that Baltimore just might be the NFL home he'd been waiting for. After the third game, I felt pretty good about, you know, making the team and they liked what I was giving them and, you know, I had fun in preseason and, you know, it was nice to be able to stick somewhere because I hadn't been able to do that. I knew I could play and I just needed opportunity and, you know, the right fit, the right system, the right place to be and, you know, this, this happened to be the right place for me. The Ravens would sign Josh to be a member of their practice squad. But what exactly does it mean to be a practice squad player? To be honest, there's no difference besides you make a little less money and you're not playing in the games. Everything else is the same. We're at lifting, we're at all the meetings. A lot of people use it as kind of like a red shirt scenario with people that they think they want to develop or um, or whatnot. It's a good experience though. You know, it's a lot of learning. You know, there's uh, there's obviously a sense of urgency with being ready to go and being ready to play. And, you know, that's kind of the whole mental aspect that I go into is, you know, there could at any given time, anybody can go down. And, you know, just like in the Miami game, Joe got hit, you know, thankfully he wasn't out the next week, but, um, you know, I have to be ready to go if, if I am called up. So uh, it's an awesome situation to be in here. And, you know, I wouldn't really wouldn't want to be anywhere else. And now looking back, Josh can see that all those frustrating days of bouncing between organizations and trying to find a fit in the NFL had its purpose. More so than anything, it, it was mental toughness. You know, it was being told, you know, I'm not good enough by five other teams. I never got a time to actually play in a game and really show what I could do. And, you know, the Ravens gave me an opportunity and, you know, I didn't let them down and, you know, they didn't let me down, give me a chance. So um, I think it definitely all prepared me. And, you know, I wouldn't change anything about it because hopefully, you know, when my story ends, it'll be, it'll be one crazy story.